Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm sorry for some reason I'm laughing. I, honestly, this shit's hilarious to me, I'm not gonna lie. So Aquarius, this is for you. Now, Capricorn did not come out, but I'm hearing Capricorn as well. So right now, you are being attacked by a Taurus, an Aries, a Gemini, another Aquarius, two Scorpios, a Leo, and a Virgo. I'm hearing two Virgos, actually. Could be more than one Aquarius as well. Definitely heavy on the Taurus and the Leo, for sure. I feel that these might be women right here, or they're just men that act like little bitches. I'm just going to be real. And there's also, as you can see, a Pisces here. So these people are, like, trying to cultivate some type of plan to stop your passion. They are definitely, this is a collaboration between all these people. <clears throat> I feel there's actually more people. I'm hearing murder for hire. I'm hearing fraud. I'm hearing setup. Okay, these people are trying to set you up for something that you didn't do. And uh, they're trying to stop your passions. But look at that. They can't, they can't cultivate shit. It ain't happening, okay? Um, these people are also doing moon magic. <laughs> and none of it's working, bro. It's actually pissing them off and making them fight with each other, okay? Because these people are trying to stop your shine. Point blank, period. They're also trying to stop you from receiving a message about a partnership with somebody. Because they know that this is going to activate you to a higher level. Look at this. Their time's up, though, so I wouldn't really worry about it. <laughs> These people have no vision. They can't see what you're doing, don't know what you're doing, and can't see what's coming next. And um, here's the deal. They can't get your abundance from you, okay? And they're pretty booty hurt about this. So I'm going to go into black screen because I'm going to get you a couple different cards. Tell me a little bit about these people. Actually, hold on. Yeah, here, let's let's go Taurus first, right? Let's pull a couple. Who is this Taurus, please? Who is this Taurus, please? Oh, she wants you dead under Taurus. Drive by. So this person drives by your house all the time. This is a hidden enemy, okay? This is somebody you don't know. Um, this is definitely somebody on drugs. I'm okay? Drugs are bad, boom, okay? Uh, this could be somebody who's working with free masons, all right? All right, let's see what else about this Taurus. What else about this Taurus? This person is a cheater and a child molester. Damn. Oh, shit. Could be a grandmother energy. Oh, my God. Whoa. That was wild. Oh, okay. So this Taurus, this Chomo cheater, whatever Taurus, could definitely... I'm hearing karmic mother, karmic grandmother. So this could be... Somebody that has, somebody, yeah, anyways, this is a karmic grandmother who's a chomo. Uh, it says karmic's family member, okay? Oh, I gotta show you this, hold on. Look at this, didn't I say that? I'm trying to set you up, okay? What else about this? t t, -t, -t torrents okay, yeah, uh, this person is not a police officer, I promise you that, but they are working with, uh, corrupt police, and they're definitely not regretting anything that they're doing this person could be like gay or lesbian okay as well let's go dude <laughs> what else about this Taurus? <laughs> come on let's go this person could have short hair uh basketball could be significant this person could be in their 50s definitely heavy on the cheater this person is not a happy person i'm gonna tell you that okay all right, let's see what else we got. What do we got for this freaking Aries over here, okay? Oh, smush. Sorry, guys. I like put some of my cards together. <laughs> what do you want to tell us about this Aries? First card out. Oh, she wants you dead, so this is a woman as well. Dang. That was the first card for both of them. Well, hey, y'all. Um, you definitely know this person. This is either your sister or someone you considered to be a sister at one time. It could be like a friend. Okay. This person could be in their 40s or an elderly woman. This is definitely like somebody who's a pill addict. I'm hearing Percocet. Malik Percocet. For the love of money, this person tried to kill you for money. They want you dead for money. This person is definitely uh, some type of murderer. They, they killed somebody. This person is a Satanist. 
Not a gang member from what I see, though. Demonic church cult. They could be a part of one of those. Okay, okay. This person is bisexual. Or lesbian is what I'm hearing. This person is a danger. This is a female. All right. She's a liar. She doesn't have an accent at all. And this person is up close to you. They don't regret what they're doing whatsoever. Okay. What else about this Aries, please? This person could be in their 30s as well. It's going to be different for all of you. Could be in their 60s as well. And this person is not a happy person. Okay. All right. Let's swoop on over to this Gemini. Okay. Just going to swoop on over. All right. Yeah, just split these decks. Yeah. All right, so tell me about this Gemini. I'm seeing phone hacked. So this person could have hacked your phone. This Gemini. Uh, demonic church cult came out. This person was not good to you at all. This could have been a fake friend. I'm hearing booty call as well. This is definitely a person that shoots up drugs. Okay. Could be uh, very racist. I'm getting Aryan Knight energy. The AK. Uh, this person also helped set up cameras. For some of you, they could have a musician son, or they could be a musician son. This person is definitely a foe. Uh, they could be working in the FBI and be a corrupt FBI officer. And uh, this person tried to poison you, okay? This person's definitely trying to be like you, take your swag. This person could also be like a prostitute, hearing man whore or woman whore. Okay. What else about this Gemini, please? For some of you, this person could be in their 20s, work with the police department. Yeah, this person's time's up, this Gemini. I'll tell you that shit right now. This person's not a celebrity, they're not in the public eye. Or they're about to not be. <laughs> this person has short hair. Okay. Uh, they like soccer or soccer significant. Brown hair came out as well. This person drives by your house as well. Could be in their 50s. Don't have to be. This person is not a divine being at all. And they're definitely in this plot against you. They could also like hockey as well. And this person is a cheater as well. Well, goddamn. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eaters over here. All right. Let's see who's good. What's up with this Aquarius? Tell us about this Aquarius. Can we get some clues about this Aquarius, please? Ooh, first one that came out. This person could be... Okay, it says your sister, but it's upside down. So this could be a sister-in-law for some of you. This could be like a brother's girlfriend or a sister's girlfriend, whatever. This person, I'm hearing, doesn't have kids. For some of you, this person could have a dead son. A little harsh. Um, this person tried to poison you. They follow you as well. This person's a reptilian. They've got a lot of secrets that are coming out. And they're a danger to their self and others. This person could live near you as well, but they are a karmic. For some of you, this could be like a uh, Northanio or a Northania. This person committed for, uh, commits fraud as well. This person is definitely, for some of you, married, husband and wife. <clears throat> for others of you, this person is far away from you, okay? Damn, these are just shooting out. This is definitely a pill addict as well. Could be working with the FBI as well, okay? <laughs> Damn. A little crusty, crusty FBI agents right here. <laughs> Whew. How did these people get a position of power? I'm going to tell you what, guys. Shit's wild. What else about this Aquarius, please?
This person could wear contacts or glasses. Not a happy person at all. Long hair. Don't. I'm a and long hair. Don't care. This person's a drug addict. Oh, snap. This person also drives by your house. They're doing black magic on you as well. That came out. This person is not. This person could have been sent in to help you, but they're they're not helpful. They, they're not helpful. For some of you, this person is in their 20s. For others of you, this, pe this person's in their 50s. They could have short hair as well for some of you. And this person is not divine at all. Could be a grandmother. That's for a very slim few of you. Um, and this person could also be like a chomo. Okay, we all know what a chomo is. Let's just be real. <laughs> let's just let's just be real right now. All right. Oh boy. All right. Let's get into it. What's the Scorpio about? Tell us about this crusty Scorpio. These crusty ass. <laughs> Okay, first question, Scorpio. I heard for love of money. Somebody could be trying to take you out for money. Uh, first, Scorpio is a prostitute and bisexual. Let's get it on. <laughs> this person tried to poison you. Could be like a baby father or somebody's father. This person's gay. Oh, okay. So, they be doing booty or... Could you, yeah, anyways, they'd be doing stuff, but they're really just straight gay. They just try to act like they're bisexual. This person could have an accent. Okay. This is definitely a Satanist here. Somebody that's stalking you, watching you, following you. Um, possibly somebody sent in by your family or your karmic family. This person is definitely a foe. Their time is up. I am. This is not a friend of yours. I promise you that. So if you think they are, mm -mm. this person was sent in to poison you. I hear that this person's also uh, copying you. They're stealing your, if you're a creator, they're stealing your content. Crusty ass Scorpio. How dare you, right? This is a hidden enemy of yours for some of you. For others of you, you're completely aware of this. Oh, snap. This could be a police officer that's a cheater and a chomo. Damn, a lot of chomo energy here. Definitely a cult going on. <laughs> what else? <laughs> uh, this is somebody that you may know but have not met before. Person could be in their 20s. I'm hearing our early 30s. Could be 50 in their 50s for some of you. This person does not have dyke. Dyke. Sorry, excuse me. Dark skin. Um, and they're stalking you. This is a light-skinned businessman or businesswoman. I'm hearing businessman. Okay. This person has short hair. And light skin. See, look, look, I'm telling you, I'm chicken telling you, boo. I'm telling you, boo. Okay. This person could be like a, like a Freemason, wannabe Freemason as well, okay? They could be uh, working with somebody that has uh, red hair. This person's thinking of you at this time right now, actually. They're obsessed with you. They could really like sports. All right. What about this other Scorpio? This other crusty Scorpio. This person, this other person's doing black magic on you. Point blank period. This is somebody that uh, y'all are in the same friends group. Okay, I'm getting. <laughs> this is somebody who's gay, but I'm hearing gay, but hides in the closet. <gasps> Said I'm sorry, Mama. <laughs> I never meant to hurt you. That's what I'm hearing. Oh, yeah, this is a family affair. So, why am I getting the feeling that these two Scorpios could be related for some of you? That's not all of you. Oh, okay, this person has an accent for some of you. Uh, they're a hitman. Hitman energy here. Oh, there you go. I knew it was coming. Look at that. 30s. This person's time is up. They're not a friend to you, period. Whether you think they are or not. Yep, sent in by somebody with red hair. This person's not hidden. And uh, I'm definitely feeling also that your family could have sent this person in for some of you as well, okay? This person may uh, come across like they're they're funny. They have short hair. This person's not as smart as they think they are. Businessman or businesswoman. Okay. STDs came out as well. 
STDs. I feel like uh, a lot of these people in the spread have STDs, honestly. Like, people sleeping with each other. What else about the Scorpio? This could be somebody's son. This person's a reptilian. Shapeshifter, I'm hearing. Yes. Oh my god, I said that. Yes. For sure. Uh, you might know this person, but I never met him. This person wants you dead. Period. God, don't they all, right? This person is a danger, and they're either living or staying near you at this time. Be careful. Could have been sent in by, uh, this Aries fake-ass sister energy of yours. I'm hearing, hearing Libra as well. Okay. Alright, what do you want to tell us about this Leo? This Leo... About this Leo, which we know. Oh, Colt. This person's a thief. A cheater. They don't like sports, I don't think. Could be a corrupt police officer. Or be working, or I'm hearing filing false police reports. Time's up. For this person, okay. This could be a male or female trying to poison you. Yeah, this is a person who is definitely plotting on you. Uh, this could be a male that wants to be a female. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Oh, we fair skin. So, I mean, oh, gay. So that could be. I'm hearing like, uh, like. Mexican, possibly. Mexican descent, or like that. Like a very light skin tone. Maybe like uh, African American, but very light skin tone. Poison came up again. What else do we have for this Leo? What else do you want to tell us? What else? What else? Okay. Demonic church cult. She wants you dead. So this is a woman for some of you. Want you dead. That Damn, that came out one after another. So this person really wants you dead, but you're not going to die. Person could have hacked your phone. Could be a musician. I got the card. And I'm going to show you guys. Sexually abused their own child. Okay. This Leo. Could be somebody's sister that hides secrets. All right. Damn, this is hardcore, bro. I'm not even going to cap you down. Hardcore. All right, and this Virgo. Let's go. For real. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, what do you want to tell us about this Virgo? Baseball could be significant to this Virgo. This person could have red hair. Oh, maybe it's the red-haired she-double I keep picking up on. This Virgo. No accent. This person's not your friend. They're in their 30s. For some of you. Oi. His father. It's going to be significant to somebody. Jeez. Lord. This person's doing black magic on you as well. Sports are significant. Could be a uh, one of the Karmic's family members. STDs coming out as well. Blonde hair. This person's light skin, dark skin came out reverse. This is a Satanist right here. This is somebody you met before as well. You know this person. But this oh okay, basketball is definitely significant. This could be somebody that had the same group of friends you did at one point. Karmic's family. Uh, SVC is a gang. It's called Severely Violent Criminals. Okay. This person's part of the SVC. Damn. Oh, look at that. Blue eyes. I know who this Virgo is for me. If this applies for me. Sheesh. Okay. Yoy. What else about this crusty ass Virgo? person wants to be like a rapper 
<laughs> this person's a murderer. They've murdered people before. Some of you have never met this person, though. For some of you, uh, this is your brother. Damn. Brother could be, like, closet gay. Damn. This person's plotting to poison you. This is definitely a male here. A man, Virgo. Oh, bro. Telling you. <laughs> that was, like, the next part that flew out. Uh, yeah, there's definitely, like, some incest going on here. Like, somebody could have, like, incestual feelings for you. For others of you, this is a Virgo in your friend group that, um, like, blinky blinked their sister. Okay, yuck. The police are watching this person while they're watching you, bro. <laughs> Those, like, flew out together. That's freaking funny as hell. <laughs> Demonic church cult. Damn, time's up. Yeah, for some of you, like, your sister-in-law, your brother's girlfriend, whoever the fuck, uh, or somebody that you called a sister was working with this person in secret, having this person come against you, helping this person come against you, okay? So, Aquarius, be easy, be safe, be careful out there. Bye, everybody.